What's up, man? <laughs> What's happening, guys? Not much. I want to ask you about like uh, all these rappers. They always get a bunch of like cars repoed and stuff. And oh, they have so much money, it seems. Why? Why would they get cars repoed? Man, people just outlive their means, man, their financial means. And I've dealt with a lot of celebrities, sport figures, you know, rappers and stuff. Some of them are pretty cool, man. I let them off the hook if they come over, you know, and rap for my kids or something. <laughs> Yeah. You know, I like that. I like I'm a big fan of all of them, man. I, I can do a little rap myself here and there. Man. No, do you? Yeah. Can you bust out a rap? Good, Let's do it. I'm the R E P O M A N, and the rest is F L Y. You see, I go by the code that the doctors mentioned. These reasons, I'll tell you why. Oh. You see, I'm six foot one, and I'm tons of fun, and I dress to a T. See, I got more clothes than Muhammad Ali, and I dress so viciously. I got bodyguards, I got two big cars, definitely ain't the whack. I got a Lincoln Continental and a convertible Cadillac. I love Cadillacs, man. Oh, wow. Okay, so you're just busting out the... Big Sugar Hill gang. Yeah, Sugar Hill, of course. I like the first... 1979. I remember when I lived in the projects and that song came out. It was a 78 album, man. I went right. and went and bought one. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Right. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> well, no, I mean, that changed history. Now, uh, I, I was talking to someone earlier. Reality stars. They can't get on the Walk of Fame. Like, you know, the star thing here. What do you think of that? Well, that's you're... the case, man. That's why I'm, I'm more mainstream now, man. I'm doing independent movies. I got uh, Operation Reaper, the movie, finally coming out next year. Okay. I got Better Criminal with Jordan Delphi, James Hong, Bai Ling, Michael, uh, uh, Tom Sizemore, and great cast, man. You got to check it out. Okay. Yeah, Sizemore, man. Hey, easy. <laughs> hey, so you want to do nothing to me. No. Uh, is Tom Sizemore guy. doing okay right now? Have yeah, you worked with him yet? He's doing okay, man. Okay. You know, he's, is he, is he showing you, up he on time on and whatnot? He was on time, he was lying. The camera loves that cat, man. Dude, he's a great actor. Yeah. So, I'd like to work with him again. He did a real good job, man. Awesome. Check it out. That is good to hear. All right. All right. What is the, the, you know, after the Sugar Hill game, in the old uh, days of rap, what was like the next rap record you bought? Well, I gotta tell you, the uh, next album, I, I mean, the next record I bought, I remember, it's a 45, and it was $2.12, and it was Michael Jackson, I Wanna Rock With You. Oh, that's rap, good. But, yeah, so, you know, I'm a Michael Jackson fan. But who's like the next rap guy? I said the next rap guy that I bought. Poor lady. Well, you know, I'm a big fan of all the East, uh, East Coast stuff. Lady, you know. Poor guy. What can but I there's the you, next man? one you got, it. after Sugar Hill Gang. Because that's kind of, most people we know about yeah. Sugar Hill Gang, but then it becomes kind of a gray, weird area of rap yeah, where we know, don't know what's next. The next one I got after that was, uh, I, was I want to say it was, it was uh, uh, Nucleus, Jam on it. Oh, crazy. Oh. Dun, 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 dun. Because when I was a little baby boy, my mama bought me a brand new toy. Two turntables with a mic, and I learned to rock like the donut mic. Like that one. That's, That's a good awesome. song. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank sir. you so much. Oh, man. All right. Thank you, guys. Have a good night, man. Thank you.